What it do, YouTube? It's your boy. I'm blessed bringing you Madden Ultimate Team, man. We got to go ahead and fix the lineups. If, if you guys remember, um, Dougie Martin got hurt, man. Dougie Fresh took some took a break real quick. You know what I'm saying? He got hurt for a couple games. So we ha had to go ahead and put him back in the game, man. And that's exactly what we did right then. We playing this man. I don't know what his name is. Um, I want to say Doo Doo. <laughs> I didn't check his name, man, but, uh, yeah, man, so we, we, we kick the ball off, you know what I'm saying, we, so we get the ball at the second half, but Luke Keith Lee, doing his thing, man, taking over for Sean Lee, Sean Lee and Miss Um, yeah, man, so Luke Keekley comes through with that big interception, man, in the first possession of the game, and we're trying to feed Doug Martin the rock, man, we're trying to feed Dougie Fresh, let him do his thing, man, welcome back from injury, do your thing, homie. But uh, they got he got it bottled up pretty tight, man. So go ahead and hit Antonio Gates down the middle. And he did such a great job of holding on to the ball. I wanted to hit him again. And uh, this time, man, we go ahead and hit up AJ Green coming across on the drag route. And oh, Gino is just throwing dots to Julio Jones, man. And right there, Doug Martin just plows his way to the end zone, forces his way through the defender just to get six points, man. So we go ahead and go up by seven points, man. 7-0, we are up. Trying to stop this man and ooh, ooh, took the man's head off. But uh, yeah, man, so we send a blitz, come through with a big sack. I'm enjoying it. I'm having a good time. And uh, Carlos Rogers, ooh, Rogers, almost drops, almost comes through with the pick, man, but he ends up dropping it. But um, trying to figure out what this dude was doing, man. And I, I guess this is the time where he was sitting there thinking he needed to make some adjustments. You know what I'm saying? So I, I, you know what? I'm gonna make some adjustments. I'm, I'm gonna go check his check his team out. You know what I'm saying? So I go ahead and check his team. Not too bad, man. He doesn't have any OP players. You know what I'm saying? They got that 85 Jerry Rice. You know what I'm saying? But uh, yeah, man, his team wasn't the greatest, but it wasn't awful either. It was still manageable, but still. There's no, I, don't, I, I didn't see an elite card on there. Um, he still has stock players, so I kind of felt bad for this man, but at the same time, um, now you gotta work your way up, man. You can't just uh, complain about the card you got, do something about it, you know what I'm saying? So um, I, I, I still, uh, that's where I felt like, you know what, I have no excuse for letting this man score on me. I refuse to let this man score on me. But he goes for it on 4th and 16, and Patrick Peterson uh, slows up Jerry Rice, and he doesn't get it. And that's when this guy's like, you know what, man, F this game. I quit. So this man quit, man. <laughs> so I ended up getting a win real easy, you know what I'm saying? But that's all right, though, because we go ahead and jump into the conference championship, you know what I'm saying? So we go ahead right, right after this game, we jump straight into the conference championship, man, moving on. To the next one, Eddie Royal taking a, ooh, look, ooh, Eddie, Eddie, don't do it. Eddie, are you okay? Are you okay, Eddie? Ooh, I changed it on him. Eddie Royal doing his thing, takes it all the way to the house, kick return for a touchdown, man. So I'm like, all right, cool. This is turning into a good game right now, man. Good, good game. But, uh, oh, man, I'm a little sick, man, so I hope you guys stay with me. Uh, I don't know how I got sick. I don't know what it is, man. Every time I go for a run, a, a longer. Look, he just threw it. Luke Keekley was wide open. He just threw it to him. But uh, every time I go for a long run, I'm talking miles, all right? Uh, every time I go for a long run, I always come back sick. Um, I, I don't know if it's the air up here where I stay at or what, but my allergies be kicking. And my allergies be kicking hard, too, man. But, uh, yeah, so we go ahead and go up 7-0, to zero, man, and we try and punch it in. Vernon Davis drops the end zone uh, catch right there. But it's all right. We catch A.J. Green on the drag route for another touchdown, man. So 14-0. We are handling business with this dude, man. And right now, I just got to make sure that I keep him from coming back, man. I got to maintain clock control, uh, do my thing on defense, just do what I do. If he scores, all right, no big deal. I just need to be able to score right back and not give him back the advantage I took away from him. And that's basically it, man. So we go ahead and get a sack. No big deal. Just a quick sack. He drops back, man. He's dropping all the way back, too. Ooh, Patty Pete. Patty Pete with a pick, man. But uh, 
Yeah, man, he was dropping all the way back. I was getting frustrated. I was like, oh my goodness. And right here, I panicked. And I had to, I had to run with Gino, man. I had to run with Gino. So second and 37. We pick up some yards, you know what I'm saying? So make it third and 29. Um, make up for some lost ground. We really... Uh, it's kind of in no man's land right now, man, with 3rd and 29. So we go ahead and punt the ball away on 4th and 29. And can we get a big play? Ooh, we, nah, we ain't getting nothing up. But uh, we went ahead and made that stop. <laughs> he didn't get too much yards. And two players, man, couldn't even make that play. Uh, it's kind of frustrating. And look at him, he's just dropping back. Just, I'm, I'm not mad at him about it, man. I'm just like, why are you dropping so far back? That's why you throwing picks, homie. But uh, he didn't want no help from me. He know how to play. He knew what he was doing. That's what he told me. But, uh, <laughs> yeah. So he goes, he runs a QB draw. Um, you got Terrell Pryor, man. Terrell Pryor is an absolute monster. I think it's a fantasy Terrell Pryor. And that card is a beast, man. That card is good. I played a lot of players with him. And he's good. He's good. Oh, Eddie. Eddie, are you okay? Oh, oh, Eddie. Eddie. Eddie Royal doing his thing, man. He was doing his thing. He wasn't stopping for nobody. AJ Green, you know what I'm saying? I just go ahead and take take it down real quick. I don't want to get hit. Um, AJ Green's a little frail little dude, so I, I wasn't trying to get him get him hit too hard, you know what I'm saying? Right there, look at Gino. Breaking tackles, Gino! Gino don't care, man. Gino don't play no games. Gino, Gino's all about the team. Gino putting the team on his back, you know what I'm saying? So 721, still maintaining that two possession lead, you know what I'm saying? Uh, once again, man, I continue to do my thing. And right guys, I don't know, I'm messed. My news is all messed up. And right here, Luke Keekly, can I come through with Luke Keekly? And he dropped a million yards back, man. A million yards back, and he keeps throwing it from so far back. I don't know. He's he making 30 yard catches for two yard gains, man. I don't know what he's doing. But right there, he makes a pretty good call, and my users is all over the place, man. So, to go into the ha to go into halftime, man, is up. Uh, I'm up by one possession. I'm trying to do my thing. Eddie Royal, oh Eddie Royal, giving me field position like nobody's business. But uh, he ends up getting the ball back. So once again, he had perfect timing. He did what he needed to do to get back into this game, and that's exactly what he did, man. So now he got the ball back, down by one score, ready to tie this game up, man. So I'm just like, oh my goodness, man. This game is so frustrating at times. When you can be so on top, and at the same time, you have your, it's just so, it's just so, it's just so frustrating. So I just need to maintain and keep doing what I'm doing on defense. Um, make minor adjustments here and there for little things that he's doing. Um, and right, look, look at that, man. He just dropped it in there, throwing dots. He's throwing dots. Ah, so he tries to run the read option. I wouldn't have none of it, you know what I'm saying? So he tries to go to it again. And I say once again, I'm not having any of it, homie. So right there, I try and stop that uh, stop route with the halfback. But Patty P shuts down that out route. You know what I'm saying? You can't run that out route all game and expect it to work. That ain't how things go, man. I make adjustments for a reason. And look at that pancake, though. It's blocking downfield. Shady McCoy comes back into the game to replace Doug Martin and gains a big yard. Got all kinds of games. Oh, okay, two runs, and he takes it down the field for another score. So 28-14, I gained back my advantage. Now, I, all I got to do is just maintain ball control, eat up the clock, you know what I'm saying, do my thing, and we're moving on to the Super Bowl. Carlos Rogers, what you got for me, homie? Carlos Rogers got a pick for me, homie. You know what I'm saying? So he did his thing. Carlos Rogers did what he needed to do. Um, I don't know if that was a credit to Carlos Rogers or a credit to the man dropping so far back to throw the ball and giving all my players all kinds of time to make, re uh, to make the read, you know what I'm saying? Right there, I don't know what I was doing, you know what I'm saying? Messing around with Geno a little bit. And uh, I put Darren Sproles in because Darren Sproles catching out the backfield. Fourth and four, I go for it with Geno. Let's go, Geno. And Geno just gets taken down like nobody's business, you know what I'm saying? Like he didn't have no forward momentum, no nothing. And he just got taken down right before the line. So second and inches, I'm trying to stop him right here. He runs the screen. I read it and he throws it away. So. I'm like, all right, cool, I read that. But right here, he found the tight end coming out the backfield. Ah, frustrating. So, so frustrating. Oh, Luke Keekly! I read it all the way, people. I read it all the way. We need Luke Keekly. We like this, though. You, you can't see what I'm doing, but we like this, though. 
Uh, just use your imagination on how we like this, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, right there, I just drop a bomb on them, and Antonio Gates can't hold on. So, I'm like, all right, cool. No big deal. Uh, Julio Jones decides to drop a pass, and it's third and ten, and I'm just trying to make something happen. But I didn't want to throw an interception, so I figured I'd take a sack, and I just kicked the field goal, man. So, I go up three possessions. Go up by 17 points, man. Going up by 17, one minute left. Game is just about over now. All he's got to do is just pray and hope this game ends sooner than he'd like. Uh, as we get another sack on Terrell Pryor. Um, even though he was dropping so far back, I don't know how he was still getting sacked. All that time to make his reads and stuff. I don't know what was going on. Get another sack on Terrell Pryor, you know what I'm saying? So, But this is the last play of the game, man. Be ready for the Super Bowl. Super Bowl coming out soon. I'm going to holler at y'all later. It's your boy. I'm blessed. Deuces, y'all. I'm out.